Hello people, it's Cole. Today we'll be flipping through the Avon catalog. This catalog is from summer, fall, 1983. And uh, unlike other Avon catalogs we've seen so far on this channel, this one is a, it's like a full size thing. It's nice and big. She's a big girl and we love her for it. It's so gorgeous. I'm very excited. <laughs> I'm here for you every week with a vintage magazine flip through. So stay right here with me and let's get started. All right, so what a beautiful cover. It's very uh, simple, product focused. There's our Avon makeup items right here in beautiful pink and red and gold packaging. I'm so into these uh, little potted eyeshadows that have like a little elevated plastic pot for each one. They're kind of raised up from the bed of this eyeshadow palette. That's so cute. The background is this lovely kind of striped, shiny surface that just sort of fades back into the darkness. It has a kind of a navy blue color to it. Um, and there's our text, our Avon catalog, summer, fall, 1983. And that's it. It's very simple, straight to the point. Let's open it up and uh, see what's inside. Mm. <laughs> mm hmm. All right. The dawn of a new day in fragrance. Light accents. Avon's new collection of daytime fragrances. So, very light and airy and fresh. We have some heaven scent <laughs> beams of light over here with our three fragrances, which are Willow in green. Tea Garden in uh, peach, and Amber Mist in yellow. And then over here, we have the, the three gals personifying <laughs> each of the scents. There's Willow right here, in, who is a fresh, cool, graceful as a morning breeze. And she certainly is with that uh, lacy top. They're all actually wearing very lacy tops. Tea Garden is pretty and fanciful as a springtime bouquet. And Amber Mist is warm, radiant, as soft as the glow of sunlight. That one's a little, a little deeper, a little more moody. I love this. I love this text. I love these, <laughs> these personified fragrances. This is beautiful. Not to mention the frosted, colored, like color-coded packaging. Avon always hits it out of the park. Okay, more fragrances. Fantastique. I thought it said fantastique. No, it does not. It is fantastique, which I guess is like a... F what does that mean? <laughs> Something in French. A tribute to all that is elegant in woman. Here's some elegant models giving us a, a fantastique. And there's the packaging, more beautiful packaging. Looks like we have, um, interesting, it's not uh, transparent, so you could not see how much was in there. I guess you'd have to give that a shake to know. Opaque white and black packaging. And what is this number down here? It's like on a little chain. Or not, it's not a chain, <laughs> it's on like a cord. It's like a necklace or something. What is that? F. Parfum pendant. Pendant of imported French glass with plastic cap on lovely silky cord with gold tone metalized end tips. Holds 0.15 fluid ounces of Fantasique. Comes in soft black velveteen pouch. So it's a portable perfume bottle, essentially. Probably has like a really tiny little opening so you can just kind of dump and dab. That is genius. So innovative. Oof, a grid. We're doing some statistics now. So we have our scent concepts across the top here, and then we have individual actual products down the side here, like perfume, uh, dusting powder, <laughs> uh, cologne, perfume soap, bath foam, perfumed talc, 
So you can find out if your favorite scent, like, um, for example, tea garden, comes in anything other than a perfume. In this case, tea garden does indeed come in a perfumed talc to keep yourself dry in that wet garden. It seems that uh, if we look at the axes, the perfume talc comes in almost every scent, and tokara comes in almost mm, about half of the products, so those are your best bets. And there she is, Takara herself. It's blue! I didn't picture it being blue. I don't know why I thought it would be like red or like orange. It sounds warm. Anyway, it's blue. <laughs> this is Takara, the world's first renewable fragrance. What does that mean? For the first time, you can renew your fragrance without reapplying it. Hours after you use Tokara, renew its beautiful scent instantly. Just stroke places where you first applied it and the fragrance actually renews itself as beautiful as ever. The fragrance as mysterious as woman herself. Isn't that curious? It's like a, it's like a touch activated, you know what it's like. It's like a scratch and sniff sticker. That's what it's like. Takara invented scratch and sniff stickers. We really are starting out just with all those fragrances, which I love that because you know how much I love fragrance ads and the, the romance and the drama of them and also the beautiful packaging. Avon really does a great job with uh, gorgeous sculptural packaging of all different materials. Isn't that lovely? Foxfire. Oh, and these purples. I love purple. <laughs> I'm secretly wearing a purple shirt today underneath this green shirt. Okay. Oh boy. All right. So <laughs> there's some stuff stuck in here, which seems to be, I don't know. Like the numbers aren't, don't match the numbering sequence of the catalog. So like, I don't know if this is from a different catalog or this belonged to like the Avon, Avon calling representative. And she would have used this for some kind of like, reference material or something in her sales endeavors, but uh, it's all of these little color swatches that are in the shapes <laughs> of lips and nails and uh, like scribbles and all kinds of different lovely shapes. And they're even like textured in a way, like you can see there's some kind of like color variation for, to illustrate the difference between like uh, silk to satin and a frost. So like shades of mocha, there's, I don't know if this will get picked up on camera, but there's a little bit of like a, there's a frostiness to the top one and there's a satiny shininess to the, the bottom one. Okay, look, so right here, there's a note from the Avon rep on old chart frost ginger plum <laughs> so this must have been some kind of reference thing i love that i love love this little things that give us an idea of who owned this what they were doing with it what they're what they were up to these are just i'm so in love with this we have razzle dazzle nail enamels <laughs> i can see that each of these 12 hour eyeshadow palettes have different kind of marketing identities, whatever. They have different names to them for the color collections, which I love. So there's Soft Romantics, which is right here, which is like blues and purples. There's Landscapes, which is all uh, earth tones. Country Garden, more earth tones with a little blue in it. And uh, Indian Sunset, which is also <laughs> like purpley blue earth tones. Not a lot of variety there when you get down to it, but I do like those uh, little little names. The only thing that could make this more um, amazing to me is if they actually had a, like, a peel-off scent thing, which I guess they wouldn't need because this, this is more of an in-person selling experience. You would probably have samples with you, but uh, I sure would like to smell some of these perfumes. You and me in sweet honesty. <laughs> so wholesome. Hmm? This wholesome romance where we're riding bikes and frolicking in a field. So sweet. Not raunchy or nasty at all. 
And then there's kits over here. It's like a gift box kit that has, uh, well, it looks like there's bar soaps and that perfumed talc. Wow, Jasmine, roses, roses, honeysuckle, and Hawaiian white ginger. Mm. The men. <laughs> Avon always has these very uh, attractive men in their men's fragrances. So look at him. As subtle and sensual as the man who wears it, musk for men, in a tough brown packaging, which includes soap on a rope, <laughs> shower soap on a rope, and it's like this brown kind of terracotta looking brick on a brown braided rope. <laughs> it's very uh, heavy, <laughs> looks like a weapon. <laughs> Quietly compelling, unmistakably male, smooth and sure. They, they really wanted to make sure that the men were not gonna be, um, <laughs> I don't know what, have their masculinity questioned by using an Avon product. Wild country, this is like got a cowboy theme. <laughs> The packaging is so different for these men's um, fragrances. It's all so much more squat. It's these squat little, like, fat, short bottles, right? Look at that. Really consistent. The women's bottles, the women-identified fragrances are much more sculptural, tall, and uh, kind of slender, which I guess that kind of makes sense. Weekend cologne in this very beautiful green glass shiny green kind of emerald looks like an emerald cut emerald with a wood cork on top hair care items i love the graphic design love all of these 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 fonts these simple bottles they don't have that like disgusting like sticker labels that come off like bottles have now or like a plastic film like wrap or something so tacky and just cheap these are beautiful these texts and images you know labels are printed directly on colored plastic bottles that feels like luxury to me <laughs> maybe i'm just uh, easy to please Hair brushes. I don't know if I've ever seen these in a Avon catalog before. Very beautiful. Brown, um, kind of a tortoiseshell plastic airbrush. I can just imagine that weight of that. Skin care. more skincare, some very nice uh, action shots of how to use your skincare, a creepy <laughs> Patrick Bateman peel off face mask right there, complete with like the blank stare. <laughs> Looks like the peel off face mask comes in a whole variety of different types, which all have like very different aesthetics, very different vibes about them. Egg White Firmer, Aloe Smooth, Avon Fresh Strawberry, Avon Lemon, and Avon Cucumber Cooler. Fresh as Nature, white face mask. Splash that away in a big Neutrogena splash. Super into this into this fake desert spring desert scape, but it's not fake, it's real. That's what's so great about it. It's a practical effect. It's real sand, piles of sand with a little cactus and like a plastic, looks like a <laughs> blue plastic bag or something to make this desert spring kind of water texture in the background. That is so fun. I, the staging, the staging of these products that look real practical staging of real little sets so good oh, the tops the caps of these in that tan plastic that is so beautiful 
that ribbed texture. I just want to like <laughs> rub my finger on that. Oh, wow. Down here, silicone glove. It says, use before and after heavy chores. Helps protect against grime and dirt as it soothes and smooths. So it's like a, it's like a coating, like a silicone coating for your hands that you would almost use as a replacement for like a rubber glove. Extremely innovative. This, I've never heard of something like this. I think I've probably seen this in other Avon catalogs before, but it, I didn't understand <laughs> the genius. Would that make your hands like slippery? I don't know. It's silicone. Oh, it says men love it, by the way. It's, it's in a semi-neutral packaging that men can <laughs> feel comfortable using. Those insecure Avon men. Here's some makeup collections, Accolade, Envira, coordinates, and this maraschino cherry red. There's the, the cover girl, cover lady right there, that marvelous burgundy plastic, those little raised color, color pans. So cool. She looks so beautiful. Who doesn't love hand, the hands on the face posing? Seeing your pictures? Avon Pizzazz. It's makeup that's bright, upbeat, never ever ordinary. Designed specifically for young women for a look that's naturally fresh. The lipstick, it's, in, it's all in this kind of like vanilla, I don't know, French vanilla, I'm calling it, plastic packaging. A lipstick like, like comes up and down like a retractable pen. I like that it's called pizzazz because it kind of looks like it's pizzas, which young women love, I hear. <laughs> and it's triangle shaped like a pizza, so. Mmm, Avon color for dark skin. We've chosen three models with different skin tones to illustrate the wide range of makeup Avon has developed for darker skin tones. It's got that pizza packaging too. So it looks like not only are we doing, you know, like foundation or concealer or like skin toned, deep skin tone makeup, but we're also doing lipsticks and eyeshadows and things that would be specifically designed to complement a deeper skin tone, which is pretty cool. I love that. What a great idea, obviously. <laughs> Necessary and uh, beautiful. These women look awesome. I love that they're all wearing these like creamy, fussy blouses with pearls. <laughs> Every single one <laughs> decked out in pearls. Okay, we're moving out of skincare and cosmetics and things and into uh, gifts, which is junk. <laughs> junk for your home. So we have a bunch of ugly figurines, okay. And some mini beer steins. What are these? Fashion thimbles? They're little, little women, <laughs> little like women busts that are thimbles that are made to look like different fashion eras so we range from 1890 to 1928 it's a pretty tight window there and they come in like a like a wooden display rack i've never known a thimble collector in my life but they're kind of like dolls i guess it's like a doll chopped in half so i can get on with that this red <laughs> Cape Cod collection is in every single Avon catalog I've ever looked through. They love this <laughs> 1876 Cape Cod red glass dishware. It's like their, their crown jewel product, which I love it too. 
it's very nice to see it big. I've never seen it this humongous scale before. It's just funny that it just, I guess it's a classic. They'll never give up on it. I have never seen it paired with this green, like coordinating green set, which would be like for, uh, what's a decanter? So you store your, your libations in there with a lovely green, emerald green tray. That's nice for, uh, for Christmas, of course. Oh my god. Giftables. What a bunch of crap. <laughs> I should be nice. These are really fun. <laughs> I love this turd looking E.T. head. That is actually, what even is that thing? It's a porcelain pot pal, is what it is. Perches over the side of a potted plant. Ew, that's scary. There's kittens with balls of yarn. 22. Frisky Friends Cologne Decanter. Frosted Glass Kittens. And then the, the caps indicate the different scents and they're different colors and they're shaped like a ball of yarn. That's quite cute. You know, I, I shouldn't say anything because I don't know if this is actually going to work for us or not. But DJ, DJ and I are in the market for a, adopting a cat. We are trying really hard to make it happen for us, but we'll see. I don't know. It might not work out. DJ's got to deal with some allergy stuff first. Um, keep your fingers crossed for us, okay? We don't, uh, we don't have any pets at all. We've never had a cat or any pet at all, ever. I've always been kind of anti-pet, so... I... <laughs> this, is bit... this is a lot of personal growth for me, to be honest. Children's accessories, which include <laughs> this, which is so darling. Magic cloud convertible hair clips. Unique cloud design barrettes come with two moons and two sun ornaments that mix and match. It's a cloud, and you can do a sun and a moon, and this is like solid color, like blue and yellow plastic. That is really, 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 really cute. <laughs> Gifts for teens. A bitchy son. <laughs> Teen would love that. It's a, it's a key ring for your first car. Sweet 16. There's a, what is that? It's a fake hair dryer, Con Air. Blow dryer decanter. This holds shampoo, which makes sense because it's a hair dryer. Um, they're very interesting. Jewelry. Whoa. Love the jewelry. Anklets, get into it. It's a <laughs> it's a lucky horseshoe anklet with white pumps. That is such a serve. <laughs> Lady Luck. It calls it a bracelet, but it shows it on the ankle. Um, I guess you can do it either way. It gives you ankle sizes and wrist sizes. That is so cool. There's a pen. There's a, ne <laughs> There's a necklace pen. <laughs> okay. For the busy businesswoman on the go who still has to look fabulous. Necklace pen. Come on. They're so innovative. I cannot even believe these things that they're coming up with. <laughs> How would you write with that? It's, it's attached to your neck. <laughs> it's not going to work. <gasps> I love a graphic. I love a, a, a woman face graphic that is like different moods, different vibes that you can pull off depending on whatever, your makeup, your jewelry, whatever you're switching out. 
this is exactly that. So we're doing simulated. Oh, this is okay. So this is like a stack your own earring combination to make stud earrings that you can kind of build up with different colored stones. There's different kind of metal encasements for the for the stones or the pearls or whatever. And you kind of build build your earring fantasy. So you can do like these four very different looks. <gasps> Hello. <laughs> Hand modeling. So talented. Stackable rings. What is this? Is this another pen? Is this another jewelry pen item? Wrist writer bracelet. It is. These women are really just losing their damn pens left and right. <laughs> and they have to wear them to keep track. Wow. Okay, that's the last page here. So, <laughs> not much to talk about on the back. Um, there is a, uh, down here, an area that is unfortunately, very unfortunately, not filled in, which is that where you would write as the representative, the Avon representative, you would write in your name, telephone number, and uh, you know that's how your customers would get in contact with you and order that pen necklace. Summer fall eighty three, and then this is just a bleed over from the cover of this kind of navy blue uh, stripe pattern background. Well, there you have it, the uh, supersized Avon catalog, Summer Fall 1983. If you liked this video, give it a like. It really helps me out if you do. I would certainly love to hear from you in the comments if you saw any products in here you can't live without. I always really, really love reading and responding to your comments every week. I will see you all next week with another new video. So until then, take care.